in the last class we were discussing about the program the concept of program program means to plan to make something to make a idea for something so for this you have to make a plan step by step so on the page number 25 there is a example the example is given for us so that we have to write it this question is a example question the question is saying that write a set of instruction set means so many steps are there so set of instruction that tells us how to make a jam sandwich how to make a jam sandwich so you just have to write the steps like how you go to school okay in the last class we see this thing how you go to school you wake up in the morning then you get fresh then you change the clothes then you take a breakfast and you go to school so this is the steps to go to school but this example is asking for the instructions for the order for the steps that how to make sandwich in the last class we also see the example of tea how to make tea we have some steps for example first we have to take out a milk okay and then we have to put it on the burner then we have to boil it then we have to put tea leaves remember one thing steps can be changed but all steps can't be changed but the result would be the same at the end the tea will be made okay so we have to make a jam sandwich we just have to make a jam sandwich and we just have to write the steps we just have to write the steps so what are the steps let me write it for you so first we have to cut out the crust we first have to cut out the crust from the bread we just have to crush out crust out the crust from the bread so the first step is this everybody write it so this is the first step we have to cut out the crust from the bread okay then what we have the second thing we have to apply what we have to apply the butter means we have to butter the bread slices evenly we just have to apply the butter on the bread slice on the bread slices on the bread slices okay so we have to butter the bread slices so that when we eat the we will also eat the butter this is the second step then the third step is spread spread jam on the buttered slice you place you place the butter on the you apply the butter on the slice now you have to spread the jam you just have to spread the jam on the buttered slice so you just have to take out the jam from the bottle and spread it on the buttered slice and then what we have the next thing we will do is we can put the slice together now the fourth step is we can put the slice together we can put the slice together okay so the last step is the last step is cut these slices into two triangles cut these slices into two triangles and eat or serve so we have to cut into two triangles and eat okay we are not serving we are just eating so we can say in this way we can 
make the jam sandwich see the first step first we cut out the crust from the bread first we cut out the crust from the bread the second thing we do is we buttered the bread slice we apply the butter on the bread slices then we spread the jam on the buttered slices we spread jam on the buttered slices then we put the slices together we put the slices two slices together now cut these slices into two triangles for example if we put the two slices it would be look like this now if we have to cut it into the triangle how we can cut it we can cut it just in this way just in this way so in this way we form two slices two triangles how the one triangle is this and the other one is this so cut into two triangles and you can eat this one everybody understand this thing everybody understand this thing yes yes yes, yes. 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 Every, everybody everybody write this in the book on the page 25 everybody write it on the page 25 everybody write this in the book on the page 25 let me clear these everybody write this in the book on the page 25 Yes Adam Khalid you are right Sheriff you have to write now write these in the book in the book on the page 25 everybody write these in the book on the page 25 so you guys can take out a pencil and write it down and once you are done just send me the message i will wait for the students so that you guys finish then we'll, we will move to the next thing i am waiting for you guys Okay, Abdul Rahman Fadi is finished. That's great. Hamid Abdul Rahman is done. Very good. i am waiting for all of you so that you guys can write and why i am waiting because after writing this what you have to do after the class when you are done writing it you can just send me the picture just send me the picture where would you send the picture on the mail in the class light okay so this is the homework okay so abdul rahman fadi is done sharif ahmed is done adam is done that's great Mohammad Farooq is done that's good
So everybody is done. Yes. 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 We are done with the page number 25. Now what do you have to do? Okay, that's good, Abdul Aziz. Okay. Okay, Suleiman Sole, you can write. Write it. Okay. So we are doing the steps of the instruction. Steps of the instruction. What is the instruction? You just have to make the jam sandwich. So you put some instructions. You put some steps. See, there are some steps you have to perform. And you perform these steps and at the end you will get the jam sandwich. Okay. So these are some steps that you have to write. These are some steps that you have to write. In the book page 25. Now we are moving to the next page. Now we are moving to the next page. The next page is page number 26. The page number 26 is saying before writing, before starting this one, let's see the note on this. You have to take a regular breaks while typing. Why? So that your body, your hand, your eyesight, everything will get a rest. Okay. So that's why we have to always take a break when you are working. When you are working, then always take a small breaks while typing on the computer or while working on the computer. Why? So that your body will get a rest. Okay. So now on the page number 25, on the page number 25, On the page 25, what we have, the first line of the page, sorry, 26 is saying that, page 26 is saying that the computer needs a set of programs. The program means software. Software means programs. All the things in the computer are program. All the things in the computers are program so a computer need a set of program to run quickly and accurately quickly means fastly fast quickly means fast accurately means exactly exactly if i ask you what is 2 plus 2 the exact answer is 4 if i ask you what is 50 plus 55 it's 105. If I ask you, what is 2 plus 3? It's 5. The answer is accurate. Accurate. It's exactly the answer is. So, a computer needs a software. A computer needs a program to run fastly and give the exact or the accurate answers. So, this is the first line which page number 26 is saying. Now, the second line, we are moving towards the next. The most important program is the operating system. The name of this program is operating. The word operating means to operate, to control something, to run something. Okay. You use mobile. You use tablet. You use iPad. You use laptops. In everything, you use smart watches. In everything, there is an operating system. And that operating system controls, operate the machine. So the most important program is the operating system. The most important program is the operating system. Okay. So one thing operating system do is to control the machine but what else operating system do or what operating system do for us okay let's see what what we do or what operating system do for us 
the operating system allow us to interact with the computer the screen you are seeing right now on the the screen you are seeing on your monitor on your tablet on your laptop is because of the operating system because of the windows you have a windows windows 10 windows 7 windows 8 so you have a windows so windows are operating system if there is no window in the computer then there is no operating system and when there is no operating system the computer will not work computer will not run even you have a electricity even you have a very good computer but if there is no operating system inside the computer it will not be operated it will not be operated okay so which program is the most important program the operating system which program is the most important program the operating system if i ask you this question in the class that what what is the most important program which one is the most important program of computer so the right answer is operating system operating system okay so when we start the computer when we oh uh, the point is there okay so operating system allow us to interact with the computer the word interact means interact means communication we can't use the computer for example there is no operating system in the computer how we can talk to computer we can talk to computer with the help of mic or with the help of keyboard or with the help of mouse if there is no operating system then we can't talk or work with the computer so that's why operating system help us to communicate help us to interact help us to interact okay so i gave you the example also for this that in the laptop in the tablet in the ipad in the smartwatch everything everything has a operating system that's why that operating system is supporting that device and you are able to use it so when we start the computer the operating system loads first why because our game our picture our video our movie our cartoons anything we saw or do on the computer is running in the computer and everything is run inside the operating system first the operating system starts loads works why because if operating system not loads first how the other things will load how the other games will load how the movies songs pictures images will load so when we first start the computer the operating system loads first this is called booting a computer so starting of computer is called what starting of computer is called booting starting of computer is called booting booting a computer booting a computer so when we start the computer starting of computer is called the booting a computer or just booting okay so what does computer need computer need a programs to work computer need a programs to work what is the most important program the most important program of computer is operating system because computer can't work without it computer can't work without it yes you are right okay yes uh, maki you are right quickly means fastly accurately means exactly okay so 
द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट प्रोग्राम इज ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम नाउ ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम बिकॉज ऑफ ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम वी कैन कम्युनिकेट फॉर एग्जाम्पल यू आर यूजिंग अ मोबाइल यू आर यूजिंग एंड्रॉयड मोबाइल एंड्रॉयड इज जस्ट अ सॉफ्टवेयर इट जस्ट अ प्रोग्राम इन साइड द मोबाइल इफ दैट सॉफ्टवेयर इज नॉट देयर इफ दैट प्रोग्राम इज नॉट देयर यू कैन यूज मोबाइल नो बिकॉज मोबाइल कैन बी स्विच ऑफ इफ यू टेक आउट ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम इन द आई फोन आई ओ एस इज द ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम ओके सो इन द कंप्यूटर विंडोज इज अ ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम सो दीज आर द डिफरेंट थिंग्स विच आर यूज to communicate with the computer in these operating system with the help of these operating system we can communicate we can communicate to the computer okay so when we start the computer what thing will load first when we start the computer what program will load first so it's a operating system it's a operating system when we start the computer which program loads first it's operating system so starting a computer starting a computer is called booting up starting a computer is called booting up so when you start a computer if you say i start the computer it's okay but if you say the computer is being booting up it means that the computer is going to be on okay so booting up means just starting up the computer just starting up the computer okay so the next line is windows is an operating system as i told you windows is an operating system as no name shows it's a operating it's operates it operates it controls it operates it controls okay what they control they control the keyboard they control the ma- uh, mouse they control the system unit they control each and everything so windows is a operating system so the last line of this page 26 is saying that it has it has different menus it has different menus which let us choose what we want to do on the computer okay so it has different menus okay it has different menus menus are the things which can be displayed on the request for example if you see the picture for example if you see the picture of this start menu this is a windows 7 picture okay If you have Windows eight, in the Windows eight there is no start menu. If you use Windows ten or seven, you will have a logo. In Windows ten you have a white logo. You just have to click on it. When you click it, it will go up. This menu will go up. This menu will appear whenever you click on this button. This menu will open upwards. So it's a menu. So it has different menu. let us choose what we want to do in the computer so this one this menu there are so many stuff there are there is so much stuff of the computer are available in it or you can search what you can do or what you want to open so you can choose select anything from these options the options which are available in the start menu for example you didn't find anything you just have to type the name of that thing here right write the name of that thing here and you will find that thing from this list the computer will give you the answer related to your word whatever you are typing so operating system controls the computer because of operating system we can contact we can communicate we can talk we can work with computer 
So, the, what is the most important program of computer? It's the operating system. What is the most important program of computer? It's the operating system. The spelling of operating is simple. It's O P E R A. Op Re. Op Re Ting. Op Re Ting. It's O P E. O P E. Op Re. R A. O P E. Op R A. Re T I N G. Ting. It's Op Re Ting. It's operating. Okay, so what is the most important part? What is the most important part of the computer? What is the most important program of the computer? Everyone can answer. <laughs> Operating system. Everybody can answer. What is the most important part? This answer. This answer. Operating. It's operating system. Okay. Yes. So the most important program of the computer is operating system because it controls the computer. And because of it, because of operating system, we are able to use the computer. We are able to use the computer. So, if you see, there are so many options available in it. If you didn't find any option, you just type your word here and the computer will find the word for you. Okay? So, computer needs a operating system. Computer needs a operating system. Why? Why computer need operating system? Because computer cannot work without operating system. And what does operating system do? It controls the computer. It controls the computer. So, when we start the computer, what do we call it? When we start the computer, what do we call it? When we start the computer, What do we call it? We call it a booting a computer. We call it a booting a computer or we can just call it a boot. Okay? Or a booting. So, it's when we start the computer, the starting of the computer is called as booting of a computer or booting up. So, everybody understand this thing? Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. yes, sir. yes sir. So now the time of the period is finished. We will meet in the next class, inshallah. Uh, you have to do two things. First, you have to send me the picture of page 25 in the mail. And secondly, you have to open the assignment. The assignment is waiting for you. You guys can open the assignment and do the assignment. Okay. So have a nice day, everyone. Bye, everyone. Bye. 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 Bye.